हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू अनदर पार्ट ऑफ अ ब्रांड न्यू यूट्यूब सीरीज वे वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ इमेज सर्च ऐप यूजिंग द अंस प्लस ए पी आई इन रिएक्ट जेस इट इज़ अगेन पार्ट ऑफ वन ऑफ माई ब्लॉग सीरीज एंड बेस्ड ऑन इट सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो आई एम इन माई टर्मिनल एंड हेयर आई विल क्रिएट अ न्यू रिएक्ट ऐप एंड पी एक्स क्रिएट रिएक्ट ऐप and i will call it image search so let it uh, get over so oh, it is done so let me go into that folder image search and do a npm uh, before npm start let me open it in the code editor so it is open let me take it to another desktop and uh, let me do a npm start so i am opening it in my firefox let it start let me do some cleaning first so i will go here and uh, i will select everything and delete it as we are going to have everything from scratch and a new setup although the node modules and everything is done but this is we are getting rid of all the boilerplates here so index.js will be there which is the entry point to any react project and then import react from react let me close it then import react dom from react dom and import app from we are soon going to create an app component from components in a components folder from app and react dom dot render which will take that app component document dot query selector so we are using traditional javascript dom thing so as i told earlier also what it is doing this will render react will render this app component in a, a root id so this uh, root id is actually here if you go into index.html this root is there so this is the place where all the react app will come the whole of the react app so let me save it uh, and uh, let me create a folder in the source app.js because we are getting the app from this components folder so let me create a folder here nas components and inside that components a file app dot js it let me create a oh, it is not working it's okay import react from react 
simple functional component const app equal to return a diff with let us return it with just app and then we have to also export it export default app so with this much a basic app should show this app in the website so let us go back and it is been shown so means our app is uh, working fine so let us uh, create a search bar component here inside this uh, components folder only we will call it search bar dot js let me see if this is my extension is working yeah it is working so i will use it export default uh, search bar i don't like it here let me do it from below export default search bar then inside a div i will just have a form i don't need any action because this is not how we work in react then input type text and input box let's save it let's go back to a wrap and here import search bar from search bar and instead of this uh, we need something so let me show the search bar so i'm showing the search bar yeah and it has been shown so let's go back to the search bar and style it a bit so uh, for form i'll do class name equal to flex container and uh, let me put a label and the label will be label for search let me put search here and inside the label let me put h2 h2 and it will be image search and input class name will be there input style so this is our whole class let me save it and we are getting this image search above and uh, search bar down so let me create one new file for the styles search bar dot css css search bar dot css and let me also import it here import search bar dot css this is how we import a direct css file in react let me save it let me go to search bar dot css and here let me first give some style for this flex container and uh, we are using flex here 
justify content center align items not underscore it is items center so what this do display flex just for content and just for content center and align items center whatever is inside it will put it in the mid of the uh, or uh, browser let me show you this much see it it came here so this is what it will do and then let me put some border also is 1px solid black so we have a border let me give for this dot input styles because what i am doing i am increasing the size of the search bar font size 1.5 em padding will be 3 pixel display will be in line block and width will be 30 percent so it become big and what if you type something it will be also big this font size was for that so it is looking quite uh, nice and uh, this completes our part one of the series see you soon